What's going on? Welcome back to 808s and Kicks, y'all. It's your boy, one and only Track Stabber. So, got me a few packages in the mail recently. We all love goodies, right? So, I'll start off with wifey got a pair of the Crocs uh, trick, the cereal tricks Crocs. I myself got me a pair of the Cheerio Crocs. Just to meet her, uh, just to match her. You know, we love matching each other. Please excuse the table. I'm using a different table today. Um, I got lucky and hit on a pair of the Wu-Tang foams. And I picked up a few pairs of the Yeezy Slides on the recent restock that we had. Um, I got me two pairs of the Onyx and a pair of the Bone. Um, yeah. So let's break, let's bust them on out, right? You know, y'all want to see, let's do it. <laughs> Alright, got, got a couple of those shoes out. Wifey also got a pair of uh, the Trick socks. You know, shout out to Stance to match the uh, her Trick's Crocs that she got. Put the socks back in there. Booyah! And we're gonna just turn it like that. So y'all can see, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? These boxes is something else when y'all trying to open these two these. Whoever made this box like this, I'm over here fighting with a dang old Crocs box. <laughs> Just to get this stuff out. Ah, there we go. Packaging is cool. I feel like you actually open up a box of cereal or something on cheese. <laughs> yeah. Now, as y'all know, I put tape on a lot of my boxes because I don't like dust getting in there on my shoes. To each his own. All right, here we are. So, we got the che Honey Nut Cheerios. We have the Trix. We got the Wu-Tang. Wu-Tang Clan ain't nothing to quit. We got the Yeezy Onyx. And we have a pair of the Yeezy Bone. These are just a few kicks that I, I got within the last few months recently. And I got to admit, y'all, I feel like these days the sneaker game is, you know, it's just obviously you got all type of sneakers out there in rotation, but why do my watch keep going off? Siri, I'm not talking to you. But um, now you got resellers capitalizing on Crocs. Like I said, um, it's it's a new day. I've said this in a previous video, like, you know, the sneaker game is, is a forever changing game. Like... We always gonna have people buying sneakers. We always gonna have people like myself on a hunt for sneakers because I love collecting. But like the game is really changing. Like these uh, these Yeezy slides. Uh, what is it like? Sixty. I don't remember how much it costs. It's like sixty five, seventy bucks, seventy bucks I think. And resale for these right now going for like over a hundred or something. Crazy. Um, the hype is real. The hype is real, y'all. Yeezy. Uh, I'm sorry. Yeezy. Crocs, uh, regular Crocs, now the cereal ones, uh, sell for like, retail is like 65, I think, and I've seen some on GOAT going for like 70 something, 90 bucks, you still can get a profit off of these, like, it's crazy, man, Re you know, resellers, they eating these days, um, I gotta admit, y'all, uh, a good friend of mine said that it's not just the year of the slides, it's the year of the resellers, because, you, you know, if, if, if you can make a buck off of something, and why not? Like, I'm not knocking nobody hustle, you know what I mean? Me personally, I'm a collector. Uh, I don't really resell like that. There are times that I sell here and there. Like, I got th three, three pairs of these Yeezys, and I am going to, I'm going to probably keep this pair and this pair for myself and the, the uh the third pair one of my homeboys was like hey you know let me get those off your hands so i'm gonna do him a favor I'm not gonna charge him too much i'm just looking out for the homie you know but i really feel like it's, it, this the game is crazy with all these slides y'all like these are just something that i got within the past few months right we're not even gonna talk about what me and my wife both have gotten 
over like the past year like every company is looking at like hey this is an opportunity to make money because for one let's be realistic y'all it's convenient these shoes these shoes are comfortable i actually wanted you know got gonna I actually wanted would like to do a review on you know which which slides are or should i say clogs are more comfortable than the other which the most comfortable now everybody's foot is different so it's going to be to each his own but i can give my honest opinion but these are not all that i have like for example y'all we got uh my wife picked up a pair of champion slides right so you got the champion slides i have nike banasi you know you can't ever go wrong with nike slides you know, you can't go wrong with Nike slides. Uh, let's see what else I got. Go. Oh, how could I forget? Definitely got a pair of the Gucci slides, and I'll pull those out just so you guys can get a little look. Now, I would say this. Even though I'm talking about what slides are most comfortable and stuff, these Gucci slides are not the most comfortable. But as far as like presentation, I love the little dust bag that come with it. You can put each, each you know. It comes with two dust bags, you know, one one per one per shoe. So I think that's pretty dope. The presentation is really, really nice. Very nice. I'm gonna just pull out one. I don't need to pull out both to see them. And I bought these back when the hype was real for Gucci. You know, I never had an expensive pair of Gucci anything in my life. And I don't know if everybody's still canceling Gucci or whatever, but that's never here. Yeah, that's another conversation we'll get into on another day. But I'm here to talk to you guys about, you know, slides in general. So we have this. And you see what I'm saying? Like, it's just crazy, like, how convenient it is for us to buy slides and stuff. And the companies that are, the companies that are, you know, manufacturing these, you know, they know it's going to sell because everybody likes convenience. Everybody likes comfort. And it's quick and easy. You ain't got to worry about lacing on up. You know, just put your foot in and. You know what I'm saying? You can be on the go. So, I don't know. Let me know what y'all think in the comment box. You know, do you think, you know, the, the companies is taking over? Are they, are they overdoing it? Is the, is the you know what I'm saying? Is it, if it, is it oversaturated these days, you know? I'm going to put these Nikes with, <laughs> with these Yeezys, you know, Jumpman and, uh, you know, whatever. You know, Nike and Adidas, you know, two companies that's always in competition with each other, whatever. Um, but I want to know what, <clears throat> excuse me, I want to know what you guys think, like, y'all think the market is oversaturated with crocs like when crocs first came out it was just a whole bunch of medical people wearing these you know you go to the hospital you know the dental office or you know wherever you know any kind of clinic you will see a nurse or even a doctor or somebody wearing a pair of these because it's, 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 it's quick it's comfortable you know and they on their feet all day you know what I'm saying you know shout out to all the medical personnel you know especially my wife she's a nurse so you know i, I definitely know what it's like you know being on your feet you know, taking care of people, making sure you're saving lives and keeping people, you know, saying on your, uh, you know, keep keeping people moving and, and stuff. So, yeah, uh, me personally, I feel like me personally, I feel like the market is just a tad bit oversaturated. But, you know, they've been making slides for years, you know, Champion, Adidas, uh, especially Nike, you know can't go wrong with the with the nike slides you know i mean it's it's, it's a lot going on these these companies you know i honestly would have never thought that i would see the day that people will be reselling crocs like they are right now like that is nuts man um i guess that's just a reminder you know you never know what's going to be selling and what what's not going to be selling in the sneaker game these days you know i would definitely 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 love to know what you guys think what y'all opinion on you know all these slides and stuff that they've been coming out and crog crog not crog clogs like you know like i said you got all these that i got yeezys adidas gucci champion nike um you even get like a uh, let me see you got you got asics they jumping into the mix with they with they slide that's coming out pretty soon and honestly me personally i think it's pretty interesting like what what they got going on because you look at it it looks like a slide that's going to possibly be comfortable but at the same time it's letting your foot breathe not just on your toes but it seems like it's 
there's a lot going on all around that shoe like you know you got you know ventilation all around it so that's going to be pretty interesting when they drop uh who was another one it was those fossil clocks that just came out the other day too and me personally i wasn't too interested in getting a pair of those um the the, the concept is pretty interesting you know got the little the little things and stuff i thought that was pretty cool but um yeah you know let me know what you guys think you know and there's a lot more going on like what was it easy Kanye was tripping out on Adidas saying that they taking his idea and stuff like that. But my thing is, how is it that they taking the idea, but it's the same company that you was working for? I, mean, I don't, I don't know. I don't even want, like, I don't even want to get into the politics of it. You know, I also seen something online the other day that, you know, Kanye might be opening up his own store selling his Yeezys or whatnot, but. If he does that, would, would he still be under Adidas or would it just be his brand now, Yeezy? Like, how is that going to work? We you know, but it's just a rumor, you know, could be true, could be true. You never know. We won't know until it happened, if it ever happens. So it will be pretty interesting. It, but me personally, you know, I'm not crazy about conspiracy theories, but what if, just let's just think about this. What if it's Kanye's way? of helping adidas sell more does everybody know controversy sells no matter what it could be movies could be music you know you always hear about you know hip-hop artists going at it with each other and stuff and a lot of times some of those beefs ain't even real unless you're hearing about somebody getting they getting their ass whooped or you're hearing about somebody you know getting shot at or or shot so everybody knows controversy sells you know, I remember Chameleon that even came out with a mixtape while way back. It was it was titled Controversy Sales. So you never know. Kanye is a smart dude. He's always gonna get his bag and it could be just them making more, you know, helping Adidas sell more. What if Adidas just released those slides and Kanye didn't say anything? I wonder if people would even be interested in buying those slides that can that 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 they've been recently releasing. You know, you never know. But I just want to share my thoughts with you guys on how I personally think that it's just been mad releases of Crocs and 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 the Yeezy slides. You know, it it wasn't like this back in the days. It wasn't like this before. You always had Adidas having their own little slides selling and stuff. And like I said, you can never go wrong with a pair of Nike Benazis. Like Nike was always doing their thing and their slides and stuff. But it was like boom, Crocs was. Just a regular name that people were wearing, you know, here and there, and all of a sudden it's just like, wow, like what happened, you know? But like, like I said, can't knock it. Crocs, you know, decent shoe, comfortable, you know. Is is it the most comfortable? I mean, I don't know, you know. You guys tell me, you know. I'd like to definitely know what you guys think, you know. But yeah, got a lot of slides here, you know. <laughs> Starting to think I should just be wearing all these instead of wearing my sneakers instead of on desk stocking them. I'm all, you know. <laughs> I don't know, you know. Gotta wear your sneakers though. But anyways, I appreciate you guys for watching. Until next time, I will see you guys on the next one. Like, comment, subscribe if you feel like it. If not, thank you again for watching. Stay blessed, stay fresh, love your loved ones like it's no tomorrow, and I'll see you on the next one. Peace.